So we created an internal cloud really to, to provide additional capability to our end users as well as our internal staff uh, to be more agile and, and deliver quicker for our customers. If they can integrate the components that make sense into their environment based upon what their current infrastructure is and where they need to solve problems. We don't have to worry about whether or not the pieces are going to fit together. We, we simply have to worry about which pieces we need to get the job done. Uh, open standards, open source, you know, it's, it's been our bread and butter for years and it's helped us evolve our technology stacks without having to worry about reinventing them. So the way we went about implementing uh, the open clouds that we have here at Red Hat is we evaluated what the initial business cases would be for deploying those and where we could derive the most value. It was really about taking the infrastructure we already had to the next level of flexibility for our users. We were able to move the building of our environments for development and testing use cases into the hands of the actual people doing the work to our developers and to our production control staff. So it was really about flexibility uh, and adding to the efficiency we already gained through the virtualization we're using today. So the benefits of an open cloud we found are that it gives us a lot of flexibility, first and foremost. We can spin up environments very quickly, we can spin up applications very quickly, we can move them around within our infrastructure and within external providers. So it's a reuse of the existing configurations, which building out new systems and building out systems to recover is a lot quicker today. So the agility is the best way to describe that. It's, uh, it's, and we have to be agile. You can't run an IT organization uh, the way we used to five years ago. With the work that we've done thus far internally with virtualizing and building an open cloud platform at Red Hat, we believe this positions us well for the future to be able to start leveraging external cloud services and hybrid cloud services that are fully integrated with Red Hat products and open source products to help us manage that kind of distributed infrastructure.